Hi, I'm Richard Dewar and I'm uh, from the fifth generation of the Dewar's family. Uh, we're the oldest owned family business making jam in the UK and today in partnership with my friend Paul Deneen, Dino to his friends, uh, we're bringing you the next edition of our online baking series, Baking for Boys. And today we're going to be making some fantastic hearty puddings and desserts. Hi and uh, welcome to Baking for Boys and today we're going to be making a delicious Victoria sponge cake with uh, beautiful raspberry jam and some lovely whipped cream uh, and dusted with a little bit of icing sugar. And the ingredients we're going to need for this are as follows. Some butter that we've just broken up into some uh, nice cubes here. As you can see it's just room temperature. We're going to add the sugar to that. It's basic sugar batter method so it's just some caster sugar. A little tip here, just uh, lift it up and just scrape around the sides just to make sure that all the sugar and butter is blending in. You want it to be a nice pale, creamy mixture. Once we get those beaten nicely together, we're going to add some eggs. So we'll add the eggs one at a time. There are five in total. The more you aerate this, obviously the better sponge you're going to get. If you want a nice light sponge, you need that egg to get beaten in there with the sugar and butter. So, a bit of nice beating in between. So this is what it wants to look like before your last egg goes in. So it's very pale, very creamy. So as you can see, there's no curdling there, but don't worry if it's slightly curdled. It won't make a great deal of difference, but obviously the less curdling you have, the better cake you're likely to end up with. And then we're just going to fold the flour in, self-raising flour, and we're just going to fold it straight in there. The flour in, all the lot straight in, and we want to get that in as quickly as we can. Yeah. So Richie, we just gently fold that in. You can buy these liners now, cheap as chips, even cheaper than chips. One straight in the bottom there, a little bit of grease help it come out when we're finished and we're going to divide that mixture equally between these two cake tins. Okay, so that's all nicely folded in now. And we'll just uh, divide that, as Paul says, equally between the two tins. So when you've got it nicely uh, split between the two, uh, two cake tins, um, just smooth it over nicely and then these both want to go into the middle shelf of a preheated oven, 180 degrees C, 160 for a fan oven, gas mark 5 for about 30 to 35 Okay, so uh, I think we think the Victoria sponges are ready now, let's have a quick look. We're just going to stick a little skewer in the middle and just check that it comes out clean. Yep, that's, perfect. That, that's absolutely perfect. I'll pass them to you, Paul. Okay, let me take that from you, Richard. These are nicely golden brown, just firm to the touch. The beauty of having these, uh, these cases is we can just gently now lift them out and they can go away to cool for about an hour or so. So here we are, cakes are now beautifully cool, firm to the touch, and so we're ready to start the decorating process. So, Richard, if you could whip the cream, please. Yep. Some double cream into the mixer. Beautiful Julius raspberry jam. Lovely flavour for cakes, raspberry jam. So yeah, just to help you out a little bit, we'll just just give it a little bit, give the jam a little bit of a soften. And in doing so you'll find the set breaks and it's just so much easier to spread. Our cream's uh, nicely whipped now. Let's put, if you could spoon the cream on there Richard, and I'll just use a different knife just so as you can see. Again, either of these knives are fine, you can see these knives, both perfectly acceptable. Okay, we have the cream on, you can see the cream there now. That's it nice and even and then Richard's just going to just put that on there. Okay, so let's just give that a little press. So we're just going to give it a little dusting of icing sugar. It's like the first falls of snow at Christmas. I think we should try some Richard. Yep. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Look at that for a lovely piece of Victoria sponge. Victoria will be proud. Okay, in fact we need a fork for this little big to pick up. Oh, yeah. So, beautiful Victoria sponge with raspberry jam. For more recipes you can go to our website www.jewers.co.uk.